grew up in Iowa on a farm in the middle of nowhere. Um, the closest grocery store was about 30 minutes away. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Raleigh is a big city to me. I mean, the the town's population was about 5,000 um, and it's just farmland everywhere. That's the industry there. And um, how long did you stay there? I was there for 18 years. I grew up on the farm um, and then I moved on to Wyoming um, for college. And what did you go to college for? I went to college for architectural engineering Um, I was really deciding between being an architect and being a structural engineer. Mm -hmm. And I interned for an architecture firm in high school for a couple of years, just doing AutoCAD. And there was always the guy that came with the Mercedes for the meetings. And mm -hmm. I'm like, what does that guy do? <laughs> and they said, that's the structural engineer. And I'm like, wow. I might want to do that. <laughs> that's a good indication of a career path. Yeah. Yeah, what car and you're driving. So, That, that past, you know, working with the architecture firm, I really knew that I wanted to be in building design. Yeah. Um, that's when I found out that there was a degree in architectural engineering. So you could learn the architecture side, the MEP side, and the structure side just in buildings. Um, and the University of Wyoming had the cheapest architectural engineering program in the U.S. Mm -hmm. So that's why I went there. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Tell me about um, your first job. My first job was actually with this company. Um, I graduated in 2003 with the architectural engineering degree, and I interned in Austin, Texas with an architecture firm for a summer during college, and it was too hot. And I realized that's kind of when I was meant to be a structural engineer because of my analytical side. Yeah. Um, and my sister lived in Boston. I'm like, that's too cold. Um, I can't, I don't want to live in California because of the seismic design. And so there's this Southeast pocket that I just really didn't know anything about. And so my senior year of college, I flew out to Charlotte for spring break yeah. and went door to door to all the structural engineering firms. This was back in the day when you faxed your resume. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and Stroud Penn in Raleigh was one of the firms I just swung by and walked in with my resume. And that's, um, I went in and actually Dave Mikens, my business partner, was the one that was running the Raleigh office for Stroud Pence. And oh, he was wow. in the office. Yeah. I went in and I said, Hey, I'm Anna Lynch. Here's my resume. Can I take you to lunch? And he's like, no, I'm not hiring. <laughs> and I said, Oh, I didn't say I was looking for a job. I just said, here's my resume. Like, right. Let me take lunch. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, fine, you can take me to lunch, you know? And so we went to lunch and I guess I really sold him. And, uh, I went back to Wyoming and he sent me an offer. And the reason why I took the job here in Raleigh, I had a, couple other offers across North Carolina was because of my immediate connection with Dave Mikens. Mm -hmm. um, I really respected him and I felt like he respected me and I feel like he could have, um, I felt like he really could have taken me places. So that's, I started with Raleigh and the Raleigh Stroud Pence office in 2003. 